All right, folks, so we are starting off with another match against Meta. Let's see. Ooh, a Meta Max C. All right, so let's see what you got. Okay, no, never mind. Oops, King Noob, let's see what you got going on. It's a TCG. A lot of people over here trying to play them needle fibers. Oh, God. Oh, no. Are you going to accept it? I want to play. What, what does that mean? You the fuck? No. What are you talking about, my guy? No. What's going on? Yo, you gonna play or not? No! Yo, what 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 is this? Who why are they arguing? <laughs> why are they what the hell? <laughs> Yo, what was that man? Yo, can we just get a duel? Can we just get a duel here? Thank you. Come on, let's get it. Let's get it popping. Damn it, we have lost every rock, paper, scissors today. Even though we only played two games. <laughs> We've lost every single one of them out of her oh my lord it's oh this hand is decent oh my god all right all right all right y'all trying to get me what i'm gonna ash it i'm just <laughs> all right uh new spectators there we go we're not gonna ash that should i have ashed it i think i probably should have ashed it oh we have drawn that i probably should have ashed it all right so let's go pre-prep um all right this game is just most likely like 1000 percent over i don't even I don't even know what to say about this. Uh, we're not going to use Unizombie's effect because we definitely don't want that to trigger. Um, so we'll summon that. We'll use Mizuki and Unizombie, I guess. Let's use Mizuki and I think I'm gonna I'm gonna kill him. So I don't I don't think I need I don't think I need this. Yeah, let's let's do that. I think I'm gonna kill him. So um, we'll normal summon that. We'll go sucker. Um, yes, 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 we did not use Unizombie. That's, that, that is an atrocity in itself. But we have drawn all these good cards. I don't even know what to do with it. Um, but yeah, man, we have not used it. That is just, that's probably the one and only time you don't use Unizombie. It's the only one and only time. Don't draw it. There we go. All right, so we'll just call monsters and just shut this whole entire deck down. And then now we'll just go our plays because he doesn't, he can't impermanence me unless I get rid of his card, which I'm not going to do. And even if I, if he... Even if I do get rid of the card, I'm just gonna um, easily put an Ibly on his board. So still, at that point in time, he would not be able to do it. Um, so that's cool. Um, all right, so we'll just do this. We will try to speed through these plays as fast as we can here because it looks like, um, you know, a lot of people just like to quit, man. A lot of people just like to quit, you know. And I don't kind of—I I mean, I kind of don't blame them, but I kind of do because it's like, yo, don't get mad at me, man. Get mad at the deck. And you know, I think that's exactly what they're doing—is getting mad at the deck. Um, all right, so here we'll just search Samurai Skull. We are know these plays. We don't need to. Uh, we don't need to. Uh, uh, guess and do this to our opponent. Um, yeah. And I like this play a lot better because uh, you're able to get two. Uh, you're able to get two Gotham Zombie searches before you start doing any of your plays, which is cool. Um, and then uh, here we'll just grab Vampire Core. Um, I actually should have grabbed what's the name. That was a. Uh, that was my mistake. I da damn sure should have grabbed, uh, what do you call it? What is his name? Fuck. Uh, uh, damn it. The, the one star, the vampire. That guy. Should have grabbed that guy. I forgot his name. Uh, I really forgot his name. Wow. Familiar. There we go. <laughs> we definitely should have grabbed Familiar. Uh, we'll definitely draw a free card. That's actually really freaking cool. We'll go this. We're not going to give him Ibley because we're going to go for game here. Um, no Ibly, no Firewall, absolutely, activate that, we'll discard Executor because we've drawn it, no need to reveal more information, there's a World Legacy Inheritor, let's grab this Familiar here, and then now since we do have Familiar, we can definitely, wait, we have two Mizukis in the grave, one Mizuki in the grave, so since we did draw Familiar, we can definitely do a different play, um, here, doesn't really matter. I, I don't. I don't think this is any way this man is getting out of this situation. There's no reason to grab Mizuki. I mean, there's no reason to send Mizuki there because we could just reborn the sucker. Since we already have the hand that we want to end with, we can just do all this like this. Well, if you already have familiar, then this short this shortcuts the combo. Uh, so you basically won't mess up. You know, give you a chance to mess up even further than you already probably are because this is a very I'm just playing. Um, but yeah. So yeah, we can just do this. Go in Karibo, bam. And I like grabbing uh, I like grabbing uh, core because core, 
Um, all right, so he surrendered. Please don't leave. The oh, there we go. He's actually not left the game. Um, so since he's going first, he's playing this deck. We'll cut this. We'll cut the brood. Um, we'll throw in the gammas here. Don't. Oops. Oh, no, we did actually click the right. We'll take out Soul Charge because I don't like going second with Soul Charge. Um, we have 31 monsters now, which is disgusting. It's very bad. And World Legacy Inheritor. So, man, we need to start cutting monsters. I, I don't know what else to do, man. I don't know what else to do. But yeah, going second, I definitely don't like Soul Charge. Um, and going third, I would, I mean, going, I mean, go, yeah, going second, I don't like Soul Charge. And the trap is pretty much useless going third. I mean, going second because you're not going first. There's an Ash. And this is a bomb ass hand to a bomb ass field. Uh, I will not negate that. Um,. So, uh, what we're going to do, like we did against the Dino player, we're going to act like we have as when we do. Um, so, once he starts using cards like uh, Scorpio, which I'm pretty sure he has in his hand, Goblin Bird, uh, we can't stop that. But we can definitely not stop the Minerva. Uh, if he goes Minerva, absolute what? If he goes Minerva, he's getting ashed. I'm not allowing Minerva to resolve. That is once you don't have a snow to your first couple of what's the names, then uh, I'm not I'm not stopping you, sir. Okay, well that's that's a decent board there. Yeah, that's getting ashed. Um, well he yeah, has snow, so yeah, you might as well ash it now. Um, no reason to wait. Absolutely no reason to wait. Not not gonna really do about that. So a cool thing about this is that I have pre-prep and I also have uh, two zombies in my. I mean multiple zombies in my hand so what i could do is pre-prep for a slay, uh, solid uh slayer uh ritual summon by using mizuki and ash blossom uh, and then um oh actually probably double mizuki if that's the case yeah i think i might go double mizuki because then if he books if he books my slayer we can just tribute summon uh solitaire and go from there all right there you go he has multiple cards but he can't he's not going to get rid of that unless he's he, unless he has a way uh, probably has soul charge but if he doesn't have a way to basically go curios off this minerva he's not going to link it off i think he isn't uh, i'm not sure pretty sure he isn't there's no way yeah there's no reason to do that unless you play under clock taker then go ahead and do what you got to do and um, i'm pretty sure he's going to go Baguska, fucking pass like a bastard and um we're not gonna have a fun time here folks we're not gonna have a fun time but if he doesn't do nothing like that then we're straight we're, we're absolutely all right there we go so we're straight top deck there's a pre-prep so we're gonna activate this one just in case he does have something for it um and we're gonna make it think like we top decked it off the rip and he's probably gonna say something to the effect of hey man you top decked um so yeah we're gonna normal we're gonna spell some in his slayer we're gonna tribute both mizukis out of our hand here uh, and then we're, what we're going to do right now is try to court him into going um, into using his uh, solitaire. Not his solitaire. You guys don't know what I'm talking about. He's not doing it. Okay. So this is probably the worst thing for him right now is to allow me to continue doing all of my plays, which is the dumbest thing you could possibly do against this deck. Because once the, once Battle Lord resolves, this game is completely over. Actually, what am I thinking about right now? I'll use this and I'll target your snow. I, I continue to forget about sucker's effect. Like I can literally just target a snow and you, I can target any problematic card that can be activated on my turn and special summon it. So now it turns it off immediately. He probably is reading it thinking that it summons on my turn. And if he thinks it summons on my side of the field, he would definitely will do. It doesn't really matter where it goes. We'll draw us a free card. There's that. All right. So now, since we didn't draw what's the name or that, we're definitely in a clear here. This game is 100% over. We'll activate that. We'll banish evolution. We'll call monster cards just in case this man's feeling froggy. Um, and another cool thing we could have did was summon it right there, and then he went to summon sorceress, and then basically we've been able to uh, summon what's the name. No need to use that. Uh, we'll grab us a executor, and we could have targeted this and special summoned. Um, our goblin zombie off of that so that would have been cool um but we still haven't conducted our normal summon so just just remember that folks um we still haven't conducted our normal summon so we technically still have two um so we'll go uh no we won't, we won't do that uh let me see here so <laughs> i'm trying to see if I, how can i get game i definitely can extra link him i can extra link him 
and burn that last card out of his hand, burn it for 3,000. I think that's what I want to do here. Do I want to do that? I think I do. I don't even think I want that. Yeah, I definitely want to do that. So since that's, that's two Mizukis, we definitely don't want to be doing that. So let's let's get Solitaire. Uh, do we have a Yuzu Zombie already in the grave? No, we don't. So we definitely want to bring that out. Um, we'll use this. Just get a Yuzu Zombie out. He's probably going to quit at this point in time because he probably sees where this is heading to. Um, we'll grab us a Mizuki here. Um, there's no reason to use any of these effects. Go right there. No Goblin. And let's go uh, Firewall. So we have to extra link him. Um, we have to extra link this young man. And we have to... Uh, we have to extra link him and burn. Uh, I mean, and discard at least one card. Firewall, Mermaid, uh, Bam Bam. Let me just special summon this guy. We haven't drawn the Ibli. Oh, he surrenders. No, no, that's only 11 minutes. Oh, God, that sucks. Sadly, folks, we're not able to get a full, full, full match because our opponent surrendered. But yeah, man. Um, yeah. Uh, forgot Vampire Sucker's added ability into basically stopping all disruptions on your opponent's graveyard or in your opponent's graveyard. Which is very cool because, well, like I said, man, once Battle Lord hits the field going second, it is an entirely different game. This game is completely over. So I'm really considered playing it at three. Um, I don't know, man. I, I, I definitely should shave this down to at least 42, more likely 40. I would like to get it to 40, but I, I don't think it's possible. There's too many crucial cards in here. Um, Gozuki could be cut. I'm already playing two units always, which I'm just not a fan of. But, um,. Yeah, man, these, these added benefits of the hand traps, I mean, is good because, like I said, you just need any summon slayer and uh, one of these hand traps. You know what? I'm kind of leaning towards three battle lords, three slayers with no executor, or three battle lords and then keep one executor because, man, executor is uh, amazing when you get it to core. The more, the, the field I'm trying, I'm not like, to be honest with you, I know the deck is named Extra Link Zombies, but to be honest with you, I'm really. Like I'm really kind of I'm kind of falling away from the extra Lincoln and just ending my board with a vampire um, Trigate negate and executor uh, equipped with core because I mean if you're, your opponent can't target first of all let's get this out the way your opponent can't target you have two negations you also have a you most likely have a Griffin you have probably got two cards out of their hand because of Gumbler so unless if you it, it depends on either have a Griffin on board or you have a Gumbler. Um, and it's it, it's just not going to look good for your opponent. If your opponent can out your board with pretty much two cards, which the, with the Goki deck you're now doing is pretty much leaving your opponent with two cards uh, in their hands. It's very hard to do it. I mean, granted, we have a two card combo that can do all that. And, you know, if you leave us actually for it, yes, we can do it. But, you know, that's just us. That's the zombies, man. Zombies have that. Uh, I'm not sure most meta decks have a two card combo. I mean, Goki's technically have a two card combo and stuff like that. But once again, you have to fight through. Oh, no, but no, 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 never mind. I don't even know why I compared it to Goki's. Go Go Goki's leave you with two cards and they still have a Trigate and a Gate. So pretty much the only deck I would say could win is that FDK deck, that Golden Stromberg, that, what, at, that or Armageddon Knight, you know, future deck. Because if you can just, like I said, man, in, in our Link Hero deck, you just summon that you summon an Armageddon Knight. You know, matter of fact, I might dwell back in that. But if you summon Armageddon Knight, you could actually link your opponent with that card. Like you can probably try Gate with just one card and just continue from there because you can get a Hero Kid, Hero Kid, and you can go summon Sorcerer. Summon Sorcerer can bring out the Malicious if you don't already have it. Um, can bring out any other. You know, you can literally just you know, crack your opponent's board and just go off and do just some fantastic, funny stuff. But yeah, man. Um, yeah, you, you can definitely do a lot, but yeah, man, Battle Lord, man, Battle Lord is just so amazing as a card, man. Going second, it's just beautiful. Um, but yeah, anyways, uh, the hand traps, um, like I said, they do add, add a zombie. The only the benefit they do add is that once again, they're hand traps. Also, they are zombies, so we could definitely use them. Um, I guess in you know in, in the best case scenario, I think I would just throw three impermanences in here. Um, or maybe even two. Cut the four, put two in. So that means what? Cut the four, be at 40. It'd be at 43, and we'll just have to cut one more card. 
um, possibly a burial because you don't really need burials, just, you know, bonus factor. Um, but yeah, but besides that, man, everything else is cool. Hope you guys didn't enjoy the two duels today. Sorry, I couldn't get the second one as a full duel. And the first one, we got skunked. But it's okay. We, 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 we did have fun, man. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys did enjoy it. If you, uh, and as always, if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe. I don't know why you haven't. I really don't. I mean, it's just the subscribe button. You're going to get zombie content. I mean, you get other content too, but mainly zombie content. Uh, I'm definitely going to be trying to get some recording. Uh, I'm definitely going to be trying to get some duels recorded. Uh, I, I, I really need to figure out if you guys have any suggestions on like a powerful laptop computer or something like that, that I could, you know, probably try to go see if I can get or something, at least price it out or something. Um, or there's basically any way to enhance my laptop or anything, because I literally recorded a whole video that I had to delete. It was a play testing session. It was 30 minutes and it would not render the second part of the video. Like it. It render for 50 it render 50 percent and then stop halfway through talking about the audio or some shit like that i'm like what like yeah man so as, if you can tell by my um what's the name video uh my my box opening video like it abruptly shut i mean abruptly cut is because like literally the second is like literally 30 30 seconds on the second clip and it would not render it kept canceling out literally spent all day um all day sunday I recorded it Sunday morning. I spent all day trying to get it to to, to go, come out, and it just would not work. Um, and the way my camera does it, it, it separates it in two files, and then I have to go to Camtasia and um, put those two files together and stuff like that, and do all that, and then like try to produce it, but it just won't go past the second one. So either you know, if you, if you guys can find. Um, or you guys know of a good laptop or a good computer that I can possibly just price out and see what I can do Start saving up to get it or you know You guys know a different program other than Camtasia where I can just edit videos and stuff like that That would also be good, too But yeah, man, I'm rambling on I'm trying to at least thin this video a little bit I know you guys came to see some oh, Jesus Christ 17 minutes. All right. Never mind. All right <laughs> How did that know it was that long? I thought it was like 13 14 but Anyway, thank you guys for watching if you guys know of any um, computers laptops anything like that or programs that I can use to ease the pain because this is ridiculous. I can't even render a video um, over 20 minutes. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys did enjoy it. If you would like to go ahead and subscribe. I don't know why you ain't. You watch this video. Um, also, if you guys want to help the channel out, click an ad or, you know, donate to the, in one of the links down below. Besides that, that is it for today. I will see you guys tomorrow with another deck. Don't know yet, but it's going to be a different one.